This is Coyote News. Tucked into the corner of Vermillion sits a winery with a history that helped change legislation in South Dakota. The Oat Report's Lauren Selleck tells us the story of Valiant Vineyards. In South Dakota, there are 19 commercial wineries, but the very first one for the state started right here in Vermilion. And actually, the owner, Eldon Nygaard, had to create new legislation just so he could start his dream and forge the path for winers to come. Valiant Vineyards is South Dakota's oldest winery. Um, it was established uh, with the first license July 16th, 1996. Um, my wife and I uh, wrote the Farm Winery Act in uh, 1995, brought it to the legislature in 96, in January, and um, it was passed into law, signed by the governor, and then after July 1st, when it became law, uh, by then we'd completed all the federal and state licensing requirements and became the first winery. Since opening their doors in 1996, Valiant Vineyards has expanded from being just a winery into a bed and breakfast and even a distillery. We're going to continue to be a winery. However, we are, uh, deci we've decided to change our focus and uh, business plan to not only uh, continue doing distilling, but to increase our distilling. For the Yacht Report, I'm Lauren Solick. For more on the story of Valiant Vineyards, visit the Volant online.